consultant detective, us, who's the player, boxer, swordsman, and a brother of Minecraft. Those are the non obvious characteristics that a person might not have thought about me. Other obvious characteristics about me I'm a chemist, a detective, I smoke a pipe, and a very handsome man. <laughs> Another version of me? Since this is basically an analysis about me, I can simply tell that you need to know my strengths and weaknesses. Let's start with strengths. My major strength is intelligence, but that can be divided into two. Politics. Botany, geology, chemistry, and science of deduction. But throughout the book in which Dave Brett showed my astounding deduction skills, if you don't know what that is, Deduction is simply decrypting something or someone by using common sense, similar to a mix of working backwards and crossing inferences out. Continue to do so until there's one last inference, which would be the conclusion. Now, weaknesses, well, I don't really have any weaknesses, but there are some things I don't quite know, or John wrote down my limits. I lack knowledge of literature, philosophy, Astronomy and the right way to treat women. <laughs> As for attitude, I am very contemplative, judgmental, and critical. I am also usually jovial. Other people have different thoughts. They think I'm sarcastic, mocking, and quizzical. They are right, of course. I can be at those times, but we don't. Even though I'm bold and adventurous. I contain great secrets that people might not know about me. For example, the true identity of my parents, where and when I was born, and I am also based on the truth on a real man who was Dr. Joseph Bell. All those were secrets of mine. I may have more, but I shall hold my tongue. In a novel they've read, I studied Scarlet, I was defined as one of the main characters. I was basically THE main character, the man who kept the story going, or as you might have to say, the character that drives the plot of the story. I drove the story by simply finding clues and using my impressive skills of deduction. And I also, basically, almost everywhere I go in the story, the reader follows. It's as if you're being followed all the time. Again, in the book that David read, I was merely described, but now I gave additional characteristics of who I am, and also a soft mystery. Yeah.